Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, hi, welcome. My name is Raya and thank you so much for tuning in. So today's video is going to be about rainy day outfits. It's a very kind of gold, gold cold, gloomy, doomy day and we get a lot of that in the spring here in the UK and I'm sure in many parts of the world you get that kind of day where it's just like dark dingy cold personally i don't mind it it's like my day to watch i don't know like a cartoon a disney film and like eat snacks and be a slob basically so i've got some clothes here and i'm going to show you two essential items here and first of all this is a jacket a raincoat it's very thin it's like almost paper thin it's from i picked it up from a, a, a boutique in bruges called I don't know, but I follow them on Instagram and I've absolutely forgotten what they're called. But they were really great and I actually picked this up on the sale in Bruges. So that was wonderful. It's from a company called Rains. And there's, a, there's another company called Save the Duck. Which I think, I don't know if it's Italian or European. I think it's quite, I'm quite sure it's European. Anyways, Rains, you can still get that. But I think you had to pay an extra duty over a certain amount. Because of the whole Brexit thing. But it has a hood, which I love. This is great. I've worn it so much. I've owned it for four years. And you can machine wash it and absolutely love it. A cap. A cap is something that will go with this. Especially when I put the hood on. You'll see what I'm talking about. This will keep your face dry. Um, hopefully, depending on which direction the wind is blowing in, of course. Um, but I do like a good old cap. This is a shower proof coat. This is from Marc Jacobs. I've had it for over 10 years and I lost it and I recently found it. I stopped wearing it for such a long time. I feel like it's a bit small now because I was a lot smaller back then. So I don't feel like this like fits properly, but I will put it on and just wear it open for you guys to see. It's a matte jacket, a trench coat. A lot of you have like trench coats, so you guys are probably, you get the vibe, right? I got these, these are a petite size. This looks really interesting. I love the colour. They are really nice taupey colour. Let me see if I can zoom you in. There. It's a tiny bit darker in real life. Like a blushy colour. If this fits, I'm keeping this. And I'm actually wearing it today. Because I want to. I will wear that probably with... I'm going to show you a couple of different ways I would wear it. Um, one is with a bodysuit. And with this blazer, this blazer I did pick up from River Island and then I sent it back and I got a new one so this still has the tag in. Uh, I got this in a size up. It wasn't like comfortable for me around here and here. Um, like it felt like I was doing this so I'm going to try it on but I just thought this, this and those like leggings work fabulously together. Possibly the hat as well and this color like throw over but i feel like the blazer might not fit underneath this so let's let's see i will try it on for you okay so i've got this um this bodysuit on now the leggings they fit they're a bit a little bit roomy at the back which i honestly don't mind but what really like doesn't look great on me is around my knees so like I feel like I have to constantly pull this up and I had this with like the new look leggings and I just feel like this doesn't suit me. Like it just feels like it's gathering up to here and I just need to pull it up. But I do like this look and I'm not sure if I like the back bit so much. Like it just looks a bit like not doing me any favours. So this is the blazer. I really like the look of the blazer with this. I think it looks really chic and the hat I think if you want to go out like this this is fine maybe a t-shirt or something if you want to be like a bit more casual but this is like perfect like this is perfect I think I'm gonna put some shoes on and if you wanted to make it more casual then you could wear a hat Maybe I could wear this with a t-shirt and a hoodie underneath. I will do that next. I've got these little slides. These are my slippers, um, which I love. And I've got like a, a cardi, like a salmon-y 
pinky cardi well it's a jumper slash cardi from h&m and this is from zara this is another bodysuit so i've kept the same leggings on because i wanted to show you another way i would wear this which is similar to probably the first one but more kind of casual smart and not so like casual as the last look so i've got this bodysuit it's like a salmon-y color so it's a lot lighter than what i had on before and i've still got these on i've still got these uh, sneakers on because they're very comfortable i've got some suede boots that would look really nice the only thing is that suede and water don't mix well but i'll show you anyway so i feel like this color goes really well but really i would not if i'm going to be honest with you i would not wear this if i know it's raining if it's like cloudy i probably would but again, that's only if I'm going like, say shopping centre. So if I'm going to, I don't know, Westfield, I'll be from my car and then Westfield underground car park and then inside. So um, that's probably the only time. So I absolutely love this look together. It's very much a cash look and I probably won't wear a hat with it. I probably will wear some clips with it. I think these are even. I do like how this looks together. I really do with the white sneakers. I feel like game on. Although these are like falling down. I'm like, Arr! so <laughs> this is how it looks. I feel like this combo looks way better than the one that I had before. And even though I would love to wear a leather bag. probably would go for something like this if it's raining um, because it's waterproof um, I need to get another bag I don't know what to get yet but I need a beige bag for all these beige colours that I wear this jacket honestly I'm wearing it with every single thing that I've got on so I've put on so far it goes really well I should probably be an ambassador for rains because come on it goes with everything and they do male stuff as well and like unisex stuff so i want to get something a little bit thicker because i was thinking of getting a burberry i thought i don't want to spend that much like right now so maybe like a thicker jacket like this would be absolutely perfect And I am going to put a hoodie on. I don't know if, like before I had a shortage of sweatshirts. I've got sweatshirts, now I have a shortage of hoodies. Someone please tell me. Um, this is actually, I don't know if it's got a stain on it or I've got a mark, I don't know what I've done to it. Anyways, there is something here. But this I think would look really cute with this and a pair of trainers. So I'm gonna try that on for you. So I've just paired it with this tennis sweatshirt which i absolutely love and have just lived in for since i've got it i think this or a hoodie would look really nice with these vinyl leggings and sneakers like i think it's a lovely look even the look that i wore before i really like the only my only gripe with these trousers are is that they keep falling down I've got some vinyl, these are new, I haven't worn them, they still have the tags on, so I'm gonna see what that looks like. Okay, so I absolutely love these. These feel like they fit a lot better around here. They are both the same size. I don't know if this is petite or not, maybe that's why it feels a lot better. What I will say around the knee, like it gathers, like I'm not wearing shoes right now, but like it kind of gathers a bit more here. And I don't know if that's meant to be the style, I like honestly don't know but I do really like these I really like them a lot actually and let me just like put something here so I don't sound so squeaky I absolutely love this and you know what I would I would wear it with these because they are near enough somewhere similar actually got a really bad blister on the back of my foot so I, I don't want to put shoes on today but I have to go out for a bit so ow. perfect 
Wow. I think I can get away with this colour if because it's got brown in this top. And this is the back bit. My bum looks like a latex balloon, but um, you know you get those balloons. <laughs> Anyways as well but this i'll probably wear this hat with something else so this is like one outfit and i'll go and get the uh, trench coat so this is the trench coat with this i really like this together because it is like a chocolate brown i don't i've got a chocolate brown but it's more of a matte leather this is obviously high gloss like shiny so for a rainy day perfect and okay i don't think this looks nice tied up yeah, pro I think I always used to wear it like this, I think. Yeah, I just used to wear it tied up. Because this was always like a little bit big for me and now I'm older, like, it's just right. Um, yeah, I can just about do up um, stuff. But yeah, absolutely live this. Let me know what you guys think. Really like this actually. Um, and because of the boots go with it, it's nice. But the knee bit really frustrates me. Like, it just gathers. Can someone tell me what to do But about this like knee bit? It just gathers. Like, now what does one do? Like, do I constantly, like, is this the look? I don't know. I don't know, maybe, I don't know. Okay, I need to pop in Tesco, so I probably won't wear this today. But actually, I don't know. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm going to try it on with a hoodie now to make it more kind of day appropriate. But if you're like going out, it feels like very high fashion. Um, you know, dressed up with a jumper, a trench coat. I think it looks really lovely. got this satin shirt on which I absolutely love with these leggings I think I might just wear it like this I tend to roll them up but I think with this look I'd probably wear it like a bit more casual and relaxed because it's such like a high gloss it just feels dressy so I just want to kind of make this feel as relaxed as possible if I wanted to wear it with a blazer and then a jacket I would but I quite like this blazer it was feeling like the neck bit was feeling really tight and I didn't know whether to keep it. It was really like, I don't know, all of a sudden it feels okay, which is strange, but I don't know. So again, if you want to wear it for like, I don't know, work, depending on where you work, of course. I mean, the other trousers I could get away with with work. They are lighter. I think just about, I'm not too sure actually. Um, but like, obviously like, this is such a cool look, so I like. But again, like bar, like restaurant, going for a drink, meeting up with the girls, guys, friends, family, you know, this could work. Now, I was going to put the trench on, but I want to do, like, another outfit, but incorporating this. I don't know if you can call it a different outfit. Maybe not. Maybe you can. Let me know. And this is one of my other looks. I would wear this jumper. I really need some, like, hoodies. I know I've got this one. I've got some sweatshirts, but I don't really have any, like, lighter hoodies. I've got... Yeah, I don't think I do. I probably need to get some more. But this is quite comfortable because sometimes I hate it when they pull back. So I would wear my hair in a bun like this, um, like this, and wear it with a pair of sneakers. This is doing the gathered up thing again, which is really annoying. Like, I don't know what I need to do, like grow longer legs, find a smaller size, find a shorter size, like a shorter leg size. I don't know. But this is the, the look, the look. And again, I mean, I could definitely wear it with this jacket, or I can wear it with a lighter one. I feel, because of the hoodie, I feel like this could work. In fact, I might very well wear this outfit out today. 
But it feels tight here. Do you see what I mean? Like this jacket, like I've had for yonks. And I think it's because it's all gathered up, actually. Let me try. Okay, that didn't help that much. Didn't really help. But never mind. Like this outfit together. Like, this is a great cash look. Obviously, the vinyl and the tennis vibe. Not something that, I'm, that I've ever seen together. But you get my gist with the hoodie, right? So I would love to know which outfit you liked out of like the two pairs of leggings. I was going to wear like the black pair of leggings and I thought they're not like, these are new. So I wanted to see like how many ways I could wear this. So I decided to wear it like with three different looks, two different leggings. So you can get like the most wear out of them. Do let me know what you think and um do let me know what you think i don't feel like this green is going with this but i i honestly don't have a hoodie that will match with this i want a plain hoodie i'm gonna go and have a look today yeah so this hoodie so in case you guys are wondering like this hoodie i probably wouldn't really go out with this maybe a black pair like of faux leather not necessarily lit the um the vinyl but um, I would love to hear your thoughts. So I hope that kind of gave you an idea um, with the three different ways you could wear either legging. And I hope it inspired you to be more confident and go out and actually wear them. Because um, I think they look really cool and really high fashion. Especially on a rainy day like this, I feel like you can definitely get away in the spring, like, summer-ish time. And if you like the video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. And I can't wait to see you all soon in my next video. Love you loads. Bye.